Hello, this is Chaos Balloon. Welcome back to Fort Condor! AGAIN! Because there's another fight now that- Wait, what? Oh, I don't- I don't- I don't have enough money. Uh, one- one second. I had enough money- Wait, you, I need 4,000? But you- you only need three! Huh. That's weird. Uh, I had enough money, but then I gave it all to him. <laughs> oh, I- I'll just sell a few things. We will sell... Uh... That'll work! Sure. I mean... I, I stole at least four ethers while I was doing... Uh, limit grinding with Aerith. You can steal ethers from Art. Dragon's very useful. Um, so... It's not like I'm even behind on where I was before. I'm not sure how many of these exactly I stole, but it was at least four. Okay, let's go. You should never deploy fire catapults. If you're actually playing it, I, I'm i really convinced that the best way to do it is to immediately, like, basically pause scum so you can get your units down, so you can place them basically very near the bottom. They can just kill the stuff that's spawning, and you don't need to fight the rest. Something like that. Yeah, I mean... I don't know... Actually, if you did that with traps, that would probably be pretty effective. I mean, I don't know how cost-efficient that is, but I know it's the most time-efficient way to do it. It, it... You know, if you actually want the prizes. The most time efficient way to do it, period, is to do what I'm doing, and just not fight anything at all. You don't lose your money, because you didn't spend any of it hiring mercenaries or building traps. And you don't need to spend a lot of time, you know, killing everything, and directing, and you playing an RTS, basically. Final Fantasy VI, this is not. That was actually a really cool sequence, though. When we had to defend Terra from Kefka's army with... Which is probably what this draws from, to be honest. But that was a lot cooler. In part because we got to use the whole part... Our whole party for it. Which, admittedly, probably wouldn't work so well in Final Fantasy VII. The system is not really made... It's not really... The Majority System is not really built for you having more than three party members at a time in mind. It, it sort of it sort of assumes that you have most of your good stuff on the only three people. Anyway. Battle! Now we can use Aerith's level 3 limit. So, here's what this does. Makes all allies invincible. Oh. But I, but I let him poison me first. Uh, I don't know if this will work. But yeah, Planet Protector gives you the peerless um, state. Yeah, that totally blocked it. I mean, I thought it would, but I wasn't I wasn't 100% sure. Peerless, as you can see, completely protects you from damage, including, evidently, healing. Uh... No, don't use Flamethrower, use Beta. This is like only one of only three effects in the whole game. About three, yeah. Which, it would give you Peerless. One of them, one of those effects, it, well, maybe only two actually. I can only think of two off the top of my head. I think there is three, but I can only remember two of them, so maybe there is only two. The point is, it is almost impossible to get, except with this. Uh, you didn't see it here, but it does have a fairly short lifespan, so it, w it wears out pretty quickly. Uh, I've given him 21 thousand gil. 
So that's enough for seven. No. Five. Yeah, that's enough for seven battles. Which is important because I'm probably not coming back here again. At least not for quite a while. Um. Yeah. Because after this. Well, actually, should I say that? I think. I think after the Temple of Agents, there's one more battle here, and we can pro- if I'm right about that, we'll do that one. But after that, it is just... It is- it's sort of the same case with the Cosmo Canyon and Nibelheim ones. Freaking Rocket Town. Uh, you just need to backtrack way too far for it to be worthwhile to me. But. But, I do need to make sure they have a lot of money. Because they, they, they might run out. Um, yeah. Anyway. Now that we, wait. Uh, I didn't stay at the end. Uh, you know what, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. I used, like, I used one beta, right? That's nothing. No, we are not here. Uh, that one, I think? Wait, no, maybe it was here. Oh yeah, it's totally here. <laughs> we are going here. Behold the Temple of the Ancients. Ooh, spooky sounds. Spooky sounds. Uh, what are these? Slap. Okay. Uh, yeah, that inflicted berserk. Do not hit Eric with that, please. Uh, let's try... Magic Magic. Although, strictly speaking, Eric doesn't need any more kills. So I should probably be trying to do this more with Sid, but... Eh. Whatever. I should also probably heal Cloud while I'm at it. Do that. Uh, I would like to save my game. Right there. Save file has been locally saved. Or as you can see, locally saved. Um. Yeah. Welcome to the Temple of the Ancients. As far as I know, there are no enemy skills we need to watch out for in here. I'm just throwing that one out there. Yes, it is. Floating? What? Um... I think she understands, but I sure don't. Or Cloud sure doesn't. Okay, that is a man in a black cloak. Black materia. Hmm. Number nine. Did we just get materia? Okay, that was weird. Uh, no, I don't think so. Hey, it's Sung. Apparently he's been tripped. Ooh, that's an interesting thing to say. It's not the promised land, but it's still something that evidently requires ancient knowledge. I mean, I mean, I think, I think he's correct, but also, well, I mean, I, I've already talked about the Promised Land thing.
You look pretty beat up, Song. But you are going to collaborate because you're n unlike your bosses, you're not a fucking idiot. <laughs> hmm. Sung probably knows Aerith better than most. So, plop in the keystone, some weird- some lights turn on. I can only assume that this was intended to at some point be a puzzle, but it's- it's not. Materia sound played again, and then we face through the floor! Welcome to... Abstraction World. Way to say it, Sid. <laughs> we can do it! Okay, so, I, I'm gonna throw this out here right now. Once we leave the Temple of the Ancients, we will not be able to come back here. Make sure, make sure you pick up all the stuff you're gonna want before you leave. And there's a few things you can get in here that are difficult or impossible to get out everywhere else or anywhere else. Sure. Let's do that. Uh, let's also use matter magic. And let's attack. Okay, it seems it's, it's seeming to me that there's a lot of poison here. An antidote. Well, that's appropriate. Of course I don't really care about poison. I do not care about poison. You shall now die! Having said that, Aerith is immune to poison, so of course she's the one person they didn't attempt to poison. Oh hey, I got hyper jump. She no, no, this is Cloud. Check it out. Hyper jump. Basically, it's a stronger jump, only it hits all enemies. Also, it sometimes inflicts death. But we're not going to change it, because we don't have our second level 1 yet. Which, as is sometimes want to happen. Uh, okay, let's see. Down here. This place is a little bit mazy, so... Uh, can I... No? I can go through here, though. The Trident, which is a weep on for Sid. Only, here's the thing. Uh, wait, what? Okay, first of all, that's just play not as strong as my current weapon, which I was expecting. Uh, I, w I did Wutai first because it makes the most sense to me to do it in that order, but the game's. I mean, you can do. Well, yeah, but the game sort of. or the game. How do I want to say this? How do I want to say this? Um, in terms of difficulty, it is probably better to come here before going to Wu Tai. However, for a few different reasons, I do not really like doing things that way. One of them being that you're thrown literally right in front of Wu Tai when you first get the tiny Bronco. Fire shell. Okay then. I wonder if I can steal from here actually. A high potion? I mean, it is a thing. Uh, I should actually, like, I don't know. I don't really want to kill him with anyone other than Sid, but at the same time, Sid actually got his. Limit break, so he doesn't even need the freaking kills anymore. I should not be worrying about who gets kills. Uh, is is the okay? That dealt a lot of damage. Wow. Yeah, I should actually not be worrying about who gets kills because, like, the limit break is important, but the kills are not. Can I go down there? Uh, no. Okay then. Up we go.
Uh, okay, I... Brings back memories. Hmm. I guess we'll go this way. Oh, he's coming up, but we can go this way! It's a turbo either! Also, isn't there something down here? I feel, I feel like there is. But I'm not totally confident. Under Lizard. Sounds creepy. Uh, you know, why don't you just do that? Okay, uh, ooh, he's like way over there. And there is a box here. Awesome. It is a rocket punch, which is for Barrett. I think. Wait, no, it actually might be Tifa's, but I'm, I'm like, yeah, uh, 80% sure it's Barrett. You attack there, you attack there, you attack there. Oh, I just remembered. Sid is actually equipped with long- Oh hey, that leveled up. Cool. He is now immune to ice! Now what was I saying? Um... Oh hey. Materia get. I, I'm not sure... I think I know what material this is, but I'm not 100%. Okay, it was. Luck Plus. That is a really rare one. It, so make sure you pick it up. Hmm. Uh, no, I don't think there's anything down here. Right. Well, I can go in here. Actually, though, wait a second. Wait a second. I didn't go up the vines up there. So where the hell did those go? Cause I know where the rock f fall room goes. And I, while I do, I'm going to want to be in there. I don't want to be in there yet. I think. Oh, great frogs! Uh... I'm a little bit upset that I evidently cannot use my enemy skill because I totally have frog song. Damn it! And the frogs are in the back row, too. That's just so annoying. Uh, I do think you can learn frog songs from these frogs, though. Just throwing that out there. Of course, it is so much more convenient to learn it earlier than now, but I do think that's a possibility. Critical counter. Toxic Frog. Yep, that's Frog Song, alright. Uh, I don't think it has much life, though. Okay, yeah, Sid is poisoned and asleep and a frog. That is not ideal. Uh, but it's dead now, so it's fine. And Rumble leveled up. Cool. Now then. Now then, now then, now then. What are up these vines? What is up these vines? Okay, well, there's a door and also an item. Um, the item is a mine source. Okay, so in the door... Hello, sir. Ooh, there's an item. Yum yum. Whew, we finally caught up to you. I'm sorry, you waited for me. 
Those are the spirit bodies of the ancients. They've been away from their planet for a long, long time to protect this temple. Over the many years, they've lost the ability to talk. Actually, they didn't need words from the beginning, because there's only one objective for those left in the temple. So yeah, these old guys are the spirits of of uh, some of the ancients. Hmm. The silver rifle, which is definitely a Vincent. Buy something. What can I buy from you? Okay, just like just consumables. I don't buy either's actually. I don't. I don't want to buy either's. Um, those those are for selling. <laughs> Let me rest. Okay, so you're actually just a Moogle from FF9. Yeah, no, I still want to save. Just, you know, I'll do it in a different file. That's sort of the hint. You can... Be careful saving it here, for you will not be able to leave until you have completed it! So don't get stuck. Hmm, they could have used a few warnings like that in Final Fantasy Tactics, I think. This again, you know, I'm not letting you frogify me a, a second time. Have some Hellfire. We'll see if you find it it's appetizing! Ha ha ha! No, you did not find it appetizing at all! Also, we'll finish it off with Matter Magic, maybe? I mean, Cloud is gonna just kill one of them with his sword. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure Matter Magic will finish it off. Those, I think those have around 1000 HP, so... So, somewhere around there, yeah. Anywho, we are heading back to the rocks, it seems. Let's see... Yeah, we're on track. Uh, actually though, this is probably a good time to leave off for now, so... Yeah. First of all though... Yeah, gotta watch out for that. So anyway, I'm going to stop up here. Join me next time when we continue on in the Temple of the Ancients. Until then, this has been Let's Play Final Fantasy VII with Chaos Balloon. Have a great day. Bye!